My name is Mason McDonald and I am the writer, director, and producer of The Night Courier. The Night Courier follows a night in the life of the woman, aka the courier, whose occupation is feeding people to monsters. And in this particular night, one of her victims escapes, and thus the story becomes a nightmarish cat and mouse game. Inevitably, in the end, the woman is put in a crossroads where she questions the very job that she's worked her entire life doing. For the writing process of The Night Courier, we really focused on minimalism, simplistic, very bleak. And we began writing back in 2019. This is honestly one of the longest scripts, or the longest length of time that I've worked on a script. It carried over into 2020 where we had nothing but time on our hands to, but, but to write. And originally the story was going to be a, a series of like very minimalistic shots, uh, four or five episodes. And the longer that we develop these characters, and we develop the world and the, the lore around this universe that we're, we were crafting, the more apparent it became that this needed to be a full-fledged short. And then even past that, we kept on working. We realized it had to be a feature. So we are going to first make this a short to show the world that this is a story that's worth telling. A lot of horrors are, you know, they rely on the horror, the scares, jump scares, gore, that's not, that's not the type of movies that we make. We believe in suspense um, and tension, high tension. And I think that really what's going to make this stand out amongst others is how much thought and how much time we put into crafting these characters. As soon as we casted the actors, we immediately just sat in a Zoom chat for hours and hours dissecting these characters, talking about them over and over again, what every little choice they make, why they make those choices. Inevitably, it's the characters that will make this stand out. Every film that we do, we try to up the ante, not by a little bit, but a lot. We don't cut corners. We don't take the easy route. We are risk takers and we are believers in hard work. It's scary, but it's thrilling. And this, is, this will hands down be the most challenging film we have ever made, without a doubt. Most locations, most actors, it's gonna be a challenge and that excites me. I am, I am excited to prove to myself that I can do that. And I'm looking forward to doing that alongside my wife. I want to make a story that gets under your skin. I want to make a story that frightens you. I want to make a story that scares the hell out of you. But above all else, I want to make a story that makes you ask questions. This story is unlike anything I've ever written before. And it is a product of what has happened in 2020. 2020 changed how I write, it changed how I think, it changed a lot of my beliefs. The year 2020 heavily influenced my writing in the direction that I wanted to take this story. What I want the audience to take out of this film is I want them to see that there is more than a handful of ways that a horror story can be told. So it's one of my favorite things to do is to scare the hell out of the audience. But I also want the audience to leave with something other than just thrills. Something more than that. 